Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. Welcome uh, to the new subscribers, welcome back to the old. I haven't done any daily energy yet. Um, I wanted to make a really quick note. Um, if you want a private reading, you need to make a payment first through my PayPal, which is connected to my email, acasiahemphill795 at gmail.com. Um, you make your payment, then you email me after your payment is submitted. I get an email automatically once a payment is um, put on my account. So I will be notified from that. You send me an email telling me you, you know, sent your payment in for this amount. This is what you want. Your sign, your partner's sign, your question. And um, I will do a recorded message and send it to you. And I will let you know your place in line at that time. Um, if I don't have a lot going on, I can get it done within a few hours, but at the same time, I will let you know at that time. Now, with that being said, let's do some daily energy for people because, well, damn, I don't know who these are for. Um, I don't know, cards keep fucking flying out and I haven't even asked for anything yet. <laughs> so, um... Let's do some daily energy for all the signs. We'll start with uh, water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. What are the messages for our water signs? Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Okay, well, we got a couple eights. I don't know if that means anything to anybody, but... Eight is the change stage, so something's about to change for somebody. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Okay. Here's what I got. Cancer, you have the Queen of Swords. Crowning energy is the King of Pentacles in reverse and the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. So the reason things aren't moving on is because you're dealing with a fucking asshole, okay? Somebody who is emotionally unbalanced. Um, they're abusive. They're probably really manipulative. This is the bottom of the deck, okay? And I think you're coming in and you're going to say, you know what? Fuck you. And you're going to cut out the bullshit because I think you know that or you're just going to be this person where this is the energy you're going to take on. Maybe you're dealing with um, an air sign that's doing this to you. <coughs> But that's your daily energy, is you're just not taking any shit today. Pisces, you have the Eight of Swords. The Eight of Swords talks about um, being in your head. You're really stuck in your head about the situation that you're in. And maybe you're wondering why things aren't moving forward. Well, this is why things aren't moving forward. Because you're dealing with a dick. Okay? And it could be you that... Um, is the one that's the emotionally unbalanced person. I don't know. You're going to have to figure out what side of the fence that you're on about this. But if you're in your head, and the thing about the Eight of Swords is, it's self-imposed. You're keeping yourself in your head about this, okay? When you could come out of it. Um, Scorpio, you are going to be... There's going to be something that happens really fast. Um, it's either news or a change and it comes in like this is this fast okay and maybe it has something to do with this person that you're dealing with that things weren't moving forward with now let's get some clarifying cards Ugh. let's clarify cancer pisces scorpio The bottom of the deck is the Four of Cups now, and this is about someone just not being satisfied. You see him sitting there with, you know, I really do feel like some of you Cancers need to speak your truth today because you're just not having it, okay? You're about to come in and cut his shit right now. <laughs> and I'm talking about the cup, but I mean, take it as, you know what I mean? But I'm just saying, like, you're not having it. But at the same time, 
somebody is not speaking their truth. Maybe this person you're dealing with isn't telling you what they need to tell you, and then that's that they're on bullshit. You know what I mean? Or maybe you've just had enough. Because after the Four of Cups comes the World card, so this is an ending of... Um, it's like we're completing a life lesson right now. This is about... some. For some people, it means traveling. For some people, it means... Um, immigration integration accomplishment whatever but at the same time this could be like something you need to do to complete something in your life and that is speak your truth or this other person you're dealing with needs to speak their truth pisces you have the nine of pentacles that came in as a clarifier so the reason that you're in your head about this other person is because they want to be single and they're acting like they're single and it's all about them Scorpio and obviously you're feeling unfulfilled as well you know and that's why you need to um, let this be the end of this you know complete this bullshit so you can move on um, because it's like a lot of things are in your head. It's like, you know, <sighs> clarify that nine of uh, pentacles for Pisces and shit. Okay. So you have the seven of wands and the three of pentacles in reverse. So the seven of wands is right before the change. So the faith stage, you're in your head about this person that's acting like they're single and they're all about themselves because there's major dishonesty going around in this situation right now. There's a divorce, there's an affair, there's some type of theft or betrayal that you're dealing with right now and this person really isn't dealing with you at all. Like, they're... they're literally in this for themselves. Scorpio, you have the Eight of Wands. So you're going to be getting a, a really, like a really quick message about this person that isn't moving forward because they're just unbalanced and they're manipulative, etc. Then you have the hanged man who is like <sighs> chilling, but it's all about wisdom. It's about getting a different perspective on this. Some people could think of this that you're in a difficult position, but at the same time, I think of it as you're just trying to figure out what you want to do with this information because I feel like you already know, you know. Let's clarify the hangs man for Scorpio. Six of Cups. So you might be thinking about some past shit. Um, and your feelings, kind of. But you're growing from this. Maybe it's like you're thinking about how that good things used to be in the past. When you wanted this marriage with children and the total love and support from someone. But you're just kind of like finally starting to realize maybe that's not what you're dealing with. Then you have the celebration card where it's like maybe you just want this person to come home to you or you want to celebrate. I think that you're stuck in your head because this person that you're dealing with wants to come back to you. But you know like who they are. And then you have these offers coming in, which is, I think it's going to be like a decision you're going to have to make between two people because you have the Knight of Wands, which is this, like, this passionate person that wants to come in, King of Wands, excuse me, and then this Knight of Cups, which is a younger water sign, or it could just be a younger person who's like trying to be all romantic and cute now too, so you're like, well, fuck, I don't know what I'm going to choose, you know? <coughs>
yeah I don't know let's see advice for our water signs cancer prices Scorpio hope everyone is having a good night I'm just like still kind of fighting off whatever the hell cold, allergy, whatever. I'm just about to take like a life-size Zyrtec or maybe a Benadryl and sleep. I don't know. That wouldn't be good. I'm just... That's what I feel like. Just drinking some of cool and calling it a day. <laughs> but we'll see. Shit. Alright, let's get some advice. So I think the main message for everybody is that justice is here, okay? Things are going to be um, evened out for everybody, and there's going to be, like, the truth coming out for some. It's going to be cause and effect. It's like, you know, the justice lady has the things and she, like, balances everything out. It's going to be balanced out. So I think we can just rest. Take a nap, water signs. Chillax. Things are going to happen how they're supposed to happen regardless, you know what I mean? But yeah, some of us are definitely dealing with people who just want to be single. And we want a renewal, but things are not moving forward right now. No matter how much you love somebody. Alright, um, I'll just do a separate video for the rest of the elements. I hope everyone has a good night.